Hey everybody in YouTube land, welcome back to the Rusty Mark. Hope y'all are doing well this evening. There's Bubba, got dogs in the shop, and Renly, my grand dog, dog setting. He's kind of energetic. They uh, they love attention. Uh, <clears throat> something I found on a, been toying with this a little bit, but working on other things I'll show you in a minute. Uh, so, temperature gauge wasn't working, of course y'all, if y'all been following my videos, we've been building this YJ, my cousins. Temperature gauge wasn't working. Finally got around to searching where it was at. And just want to show y'all real quick. This is a 4.2 six cylinder temperature sender. It's right back here on top of the head driver's side. <clears throat> I've been uh, playing with a choke. It needed adjusting and uh, and all that. So anyway, got the, I don't know if I showed you, it's got the windshield put in. Got that part done, and uh, the uh, let me uh, grab a little bit of light here. I got one light. There. Well, come on. Sometimes the button don't work right. There we go. All right. I got a LED light that hid when the door's all the way open. Now we can see a little bit. Anyway, y'all can get a better look at that. Still got to put the stereo in it. Got the steering wheel and all that <clears throat> put back together. And we put some uh, standard, we bought some new fender flares put on it. Uh, I have some for my cousin has some seven inch fender flares still in this box right here. I put everything back up. Brand new in the box, he decided not to use them. <clears throat> but anyway, so it's looking pretty good. It's coming together. We still got another set of tires and wheels we're gonna put on it, but uh, got a new radio antenna, goes right there. <clears throat> got some decals coming for it. I think y'all enjoy that. Uh, had, had to put a water pump, or fixing to put a water pump on my square body. Um, of course, this has got the 4.8 LS in it. And again, I've already unplugged my lights. I was fixing to go in. I thought, well, I'm going to do the video real quick. Hang on just a second here. <clears throat> so the LS water pump fits right in there. Got the old one off, and uh, pretty easy to get to. It's not bad. I like pulling. Of course, you get the belt off out of your way because I don't. You don't want to get antifreeze on the belt. Um. So I've got the gaskets cleaned off. Uh, the reason I'm I've stopped and didn't finish it because I forgot to get some new water pump bolts, guys. If if you're replacing a water pump on the LS, when you go pick up a new water pump, go ahead and pick up some new water pump bolts. There's six of them, two for the thermostat and six for the main water pump, three on each side. Um, I got one in my pocket. You, as you can see, these two, I cleaned this one up with fingernail polisher. In other words, a grinder with wire wheel on it. Um, couple of them were pretty rusty you can tell that one has eroded some and the one of them was really blacked up i just don't trust them you know i don't care i don't know what they cost didn't matter but two things i'll do on a water pump on ls put new boats and i'll put a little anti-seize on the threads you know just for good measure and next time you got to pull it apart it will be easier and you don't want to break a bolt off and this, I'm pretty sure, I'm, I'm trying to remember, this truck, I put this engine in this truck four or five years ago, and I think, I can't remember, but I think I put a new water pump on it then. I just, just don't know. I just can't remember. My rememberer does not work well. Because I work on so many vehicles, and unless I make a note of it somewhere, I don't, I can't keep up with it. But anyway... Um, so yeah, 
go ahead and get new water water pump boats do that do it right and um another thing uh this is a uh belt's getting a little wear to it but i like gates belts if you've been uh doing any kind of mechanic and work if you buy a, a any other name brand belts there there might be something better than gates i don't know what it is but <clears throat> um cheap belts squeak okay they just do i've tried a bunch of different ones they squeak gates best belt i've ever run across uh same thing with hoses i like to get if i can uh gates hoses it's just a better quality product and the belts just don't squeak one thing i'm planning on doing whenever i get time after i get this put back together and all that i'm gonna get a a uh, ac relocation bracket because i don't have enough room for ac down here because it's an ls sitting in a square body so i'm gonna i've done them before i'm gonna get one that sits up here that uh <clears throat> so i can get my ac hooked back up hopefully soon <clears throat> among everything oh it's got a, win a new windshield put in this one too i had them done at the same time the jeep and the square body got some new uh wiper blades with the i don't know what blades i had before but they did not fit correctly but these are a lot better so now since i got the windshield put in <clears throat> sometime soon i'm gonna get the windows tinted and uh do that and uh because it needs it but anyway that's the uh that's the update from the old rusty mark garage tonight i got a uh, waiting on a radiator to come in for my son's forerunner got a 01 2001 toyota forerunner and it popped a hole in it somewhere up here but anyway it sprayed everywhere so i've got a change that out shouldn't be a real big deal there just waiting on the new radiator to come in <clears throat> but anyway everything's uh progressing i still got to wire up some lights and do other things just not enough hours in a day for me but anyway friendly friendly sit sit good boy he's real energetic He's like an only child syndrome dog. <laughs> he gets all the attention. But anyway, I appreciate y'all coming and uh, checking out the video. Just kind of a short one tonight. Do me a favor, please like, put your thumbs up, like, subscribe, and uh, tell your friends about this little channel here. And uh, we hope to grow it and share content with you and share tips along the way to help someone else out down the road. But anyway, for Ridley and me, we're going to sign off. Can you talk? Hmm? Can you say bye? Yep. Oh. He, wants, he don't want you to leave. Anyway, y'all have a good one. Thanks a lot, and we'll see you next video. See ya.